Hey guys, it's Garth89 here, and welcome back. Got another episode of FTL for you guys. And we finally made it to the final sector. On our first try, no less. You know, all of those other deaths, they, they don't count. Um, <clears throat> sorry. Lost my voice there for a second. Yes, I will uh, agree to get more health. Alright, so base is over here. Bad guy's over there. Now, this is actually a little, little awkward, though. That the base is in the middle this time. I guess they changed it to where the base's position is kind of random. Alright, found a baddie. He's got four shields. A good thing we uh, upgraded to the breach missiles, though. Let's see if we can uh, ruin their day a little bit, guys. All right, we've got got them fighting each other. So let's fire at the shields. And then at the shields again. Okay, so they've got a ton of evade, I guess. But at the very least, we have damaged their uh, their pride. Hmm. Not sure if we'll be able to win this way, to be honest. All right, they took out a cloaking. We need to do something about that. Right, let's let's hope the uh, the artillery beam does something. Oh, good. Their oxygen's out. That's a happy news. All right, there we go. Now we should be now we should be winning, I guess. Let's let's create some more chaos, guys. Chaos is always good. All right, we've taken out half their crew. Actually, you go, you go get healed real quick. Oh, they've got out one of those beam thing thingies. Well, at least our shield's back up, so shouldn't be too big of a deal. All right, shield's totally out. Now let's just go on uh, auto fire. We should be able to win this with minimal damage, I guess. All right, it worked out well enough. We lost a little bit of a uh, little bit of health. By little, I mean, like, a ton of health. Alright, we'll just stop by the, the repair shop quickly. Oh, conflict. Oh my. How well armed is that guy? Um, okay, they're gonna send some of their crew to attack us. Which is beneficial for us. Let's just flood all of the unnecessary rooms first. Uh, which is not the weapons room. And then we'll figure out where they're coming from. Once they're off, we'll get the crew to fight each other. Just get ourselves set up first. And there we go. Send. Actually, let's close these doors. Send you there. Send him into this direction. Uh, it would be great if you would make it there in time, though, buddy. I think we can we can handle them. Now let's pay attention. Their weapons are charging.
All right, good. We took out some of their shield. And let's close these up so we don't accidentally die. I think we should be able to win this no matter what now. Actually, let's leave these open temporarily. Send you guys to get healed. Get healed! And then we can just reclose the doors. So our weapons are out. That's subpar. Right, let's get this going. I believe we took out an crew member. Alright, and they're going for that again. Let's go with the cloak again, real quick. That'll prevent them from doing any long-term damage. Also, they seem to have caught on fire. Not entirely sure how I did that, but that's uh, great for us. Oh yeah, we hit them with the artillery beam. Oh, they took the, uh, the repair station from us. Let's just warp to the base. We don't need to take any unnecessary damage. Let's see, is there anything we can upgrade? No. And we don't have any new crew either, unfortunately. We got no health, we got no crew. I'm going to I'm going to operate on the assumption that we're going to win this fight uh, very easily. All right, let's operate with the breach missile for a second. Hop over to the repair station. And of course they made it to the repair station before we did. All right, which one of those was the big gun? Oh, they've got the hacking tool. Alright, once they get ready to fire, we will go into cloak mode. Alright. Now we know which one to target. Let's go, guys. Now we don't have a crew teleporter, which is also not ideal. See if we can get a hit off on that shield. Alright, good, we did get a hit off on the shield. Uh, let's keep firing at it for now. Alright, they went into cloaking. This has gone uh, surprisingly well so far. Let's see if we can get one more shot off. Alright, go for the cloak again. Alright, good, we dodged that. We had 100% evade, so... Alright, good, their shields are down. Switch weapon loadout. Oh, we don't have enough power. Oh, let's do that. There we go. Now, uh... We need to continue the process of uh, ruining their day. Now, we can actually, in theory, do this entire first sector without taking any meaningful damage. Um, let's see if we can just get this one on this target, and three, where will I aim you? Uh, I guess down here somewhere. Alright, perfect timing. Alright, 
we didn't take any damage in that encounter. That's fairly good. Alright, they're going straight for our base. Let's see what we can do. Maybe we can upgrade something. I think we may have to win the entire battle with 7 health. That's, uh... Gonna, it's gonna be interesting, guys. Let's see if we can do this. Hmm. I'm gonna operate on the assumption that we can make use of that. Alright, let's head back to base. It's too bad there's no way for us to get any repairs in now. Oh, and now we're at the hard part of the game. Everybody. But, on the plus side... Oh... Bugger. <laughs> on the plus side, they're gonna take out our oxygen room. Thanks, game. Alright, let's, uh... Now we'll we'll try one round with this. If we uh, don't get any hits off, then we'll switch to the breach missile. Put it on auto fire there, and we'll wait for the correct moment, and then we'll go to dodge mode. Oh my. Get in there and get healed. Alright, warning, power search detected, and cloak. This should keep us invincible for the duration of the cloaking session. Alright, let's void this section so that we don't lose unnecessary health. And let's mind control someone. All right. Yeah, we're okay. As I say that, I realize we're not very okay, to put it that way. And we have one health left, and we died. All right, guys, that was a short episode. I think we uh, will call it quits here. And I guess I'll get back to the F FF Tactics LP. We made it pretty far, though. We got all the way to Sector 8. And I don't usually get to Sector 8. So, as you can see, I've only really had success winning on easy mode for the most part. Well, I guess that was okay. We had, uh, we had a good run, and we only had... Was it... Who's this guy? Oh no, it's a different, different characters. That's right. We only had our, uh, <laughs> we only had our four uh, guys for the entire game. All right, let's go back to the hangar. Did we unlock anything? Well, I think I already had that one, but now we actually have all four of these completed. And we completed the Diplomatic Immunity one in this round. Alright guys, I think uh, the next time I try this, I'll probably try out the new ship, because I know you guys are probably really interested in seeing the new ship. However, I want to try and s test out the new trick for unlocking these new ships, so I'm going to try winning the game uh, like on easy with this guy, so I can unlock this, and then this to that, and this to that. I did unlock the Stealth Cruiser at some point. I have no idea why I don't have it anymore. The Crystal Cruiser is a different issue. That one's really hard to get. So anyways, I will see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.